the men's 200 meters individual medley SM9. The eight through to this final, James Crisp of Great Britain, Brendan Hall of Australia, Federico Malacci, the 22 year old from Italy, Discensors, Toth Hodge and Burrow. Cody Burrow, the USA first out, he'll go in lane eight. 28 year old. Great Britain's James Crisp. He has 12 Paralympic medals dating back from Sydney in 2000. A very experienced athlete. Australia's Timothy Hodge will go in lane seven. The other end of the spectrum at just 15 years of age. And his teammate, Brendan Hall, already with a gold medal to his name from Rio 2016 and that 400 freestyle. Hoping to add another medal to his collection. Hungary's Tamás Ta, bronze in this event at the World Championships last year. Seeded fourth in the qualifiers. And the reigning world champion, Federico Malachi. Won that title last year in Glasgow. Bronze four years ago in London 2012. And also representing Hungary, Tamás Sors. His best result in this event, fourth at the Paralympic Games in Beijing. And the fastest seed representing Australia making his debut here at Rio 2016. Finished seventh at last year's World Championship, so had a very strong swim in his heat to find himself the fastest seed. But it's Australia who still have the world record. Matthew Cowdery from the 2008 Beijing Paralympic Games. 213.6, the fastest any of these swimmers have gone this year is a 218, so that world record might well be safe. Chris Hall, Malachi, Diskin, Sors, Toth, Hodge, and Beryl all go in the men's 200 individually SM9. We saw in qualifiers how the lead can change throughout this men's 200 individual medley SM9. The breaststroke being a real key factor in this race. And off to a fast start is Tamás Sors, the Hungarian, taking it on on the butterfly leg. Also going well. Out in three, the reigning world champion, Federico Malachi, sees himself seeded third going into this final but a strong turn there it's Tamás Sors the Hungarian who leads Marachi Brendan Hall so strong in the freestyle turns in third and this is where the field will start to change now surprisingly the fastest seed Diskin of Australia just getting left behind the rest of the field It'll be interesting to see what he can do on the breaststroke leg well perhaps just a little too many nerves ahead of the final the 19 year old uh Diskin is being left behind here, but he is set to perhaps make up a little time on the remainder of the field with the breaststroke. And the concern for him, though, would be that Soros, Toff, very capable breaststrokers, Morlachi, Hall, all able to make up something in the back end of this race. Although Diskin is starting to come into his own now, he's got a fine breaststroke about him. A young man who has cerebral palsy, which affects the left side of his body more than the right side. But such a capable breaststroker is making up some serious yardage. It's Soros who's just edging ahead of Toth now. But coming back 
getting into uh, contention. I think leading now, courtesy of his breaststroke, is the royal champion, Morlachi, the bronze medalist of four years ago, touches first and the 50, and will want to bring it home. The Italian being egged on by the Italian supporters in the arena, but it is Italy over Hungary, over Australia now, in the battle for gold, silver, and bronze. Oh, what a strong breaststroke leg by Morlachi and Diskin, and that is what has changed the field completely, but having a storming final 50 meters here, the Hungarian soars coming through to really push the reigning champion, Malachi. Malachi giving it a final push though, and it's going to go to the Italian. Federico Malachi wins the gold. Thomas soars for Hungary, the silver medal. And thanks to that strong breaststroke leg, Timothy Diskin, the Australian, sees himself on the podium. Malachi having elaborate celebrations. A quick time, 216.72. Quicker than he's posted this year by quite a few seconds. Well, it's just wonderful scenes and such uh, incredible sportsmanship that we've seen so regularly throughout the Paralympic Games. Diskin delighted with his medal position. He only completed his primary education last year. Well, uh, Tomas Soros, 24-year-old, and Frederica Murlachi, uh, a warm embrace and a kiss for the cameras. Murlachi swam a smart race again. Went out in the fly, but didn't quite have the strongest of the legs. In the back was OK. Really took the race to every other competitor in the field in the breaststroke and held on in the free. Diskin made up tremendous ground in the breaststroke but credit to Soros the way he held on swam Tomas Toth a very capable 220 swimmer completely out of the race celebration so time <laughs> soaking up the moment there Malachi came in as a reigning world champion and he can now add Paralympic champion to those titles Tomas Soros the silver medal for Hungary. Timothy Diskin, very brave swim by the young Australian to take that bronze medal.